Ella feeling about going to school today? Exhausting. <laughs> Exhausting. <laughs> hey, you crabby pants. <laughs> Ow! What's the matter? Ella, why don't we want to go to school today? <laughs> well, that's how I feel about going to work. You sound excited. <laughs> Are you in the mood? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Are your teachers coming? Hello, everybody. Hi, Dad. Hi, I still finishing it. Good job. She's um, making some pictures today. I am. Um, I made one all for Mobby. <laughs> Thank and you. And I put it in a, on my friend. Uh, Kitchen set is. She's got a bit of a cold. Yeah. <laughs> um, today, um, we went to. I I did some errands earlier. I actually ended up getting my Christmas lights up, which I'm super excited about. We're just gonna plug them in later. Um, in and the I month. really like Christmas because I I can actually write fox on. We gotta get all this on the, my Christmas. Uh-huh. We're going to be list. doing your Christmas list soon, right? Yeah. got to get those Halloween stickies down so we can put up Christmas ones. Yeah. Um, I was going to take all of them off. No, oh, honey. She might not be going. Excuse me. She had today off because it was Veterans Day, but she might not be going to school tomorrow either, depending. I want to take her temperature again because she's feeling a little bit warm. Um, but today I kind of wanted to take a break. My back is hurting. <laughs> I did a lot. Like I put up the lights. I picked up some branches. I put away, like we have a little patio table. So I put like the glass away so the snow wouldn't break through it or anything. So I'm pretty pooped. Um, I like came inside and fed the cat and everything, but now I want to put, um, Hunter's yeah. high chair together because I don't uh, have my high chair because well, it's you technically just... have your high chair. I just I need to sell it. I need to put it on like the marketplace or something. Um, <laughs> but we're gonna put his high chair together and, because I have all his bibs as well. Um, and I saw something What's cute that? on I don't Pinterest. Know what his bibs are. <laughs> I saw something cute on Pinterest to sh like store your bibs and stuff. So I want to get those out of the way. Ella's got a sharpie. He almost punched me in the face. <laughs> So I figured we would do kind of like a time lapse sort of thing, putting this um, high chair together. I don't think I have enough time to sort out all the fights, yeah. sort out all the lies. Oh, baby, yeah. Oh, no. There was a part of me that knew that. And still I'm caught by surprise oh. I thought you'd always be mine oh, yeah, I yeah. guess our dreams fell asleep There's no passion in the comatose yeah. Baby going down, 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 down yeah. Baby going down, 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 down yeah. Tried so hard to stay afloat Yeah, we keep moving like the river goes yeah. Baby going down, 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 down Yeah, yeah. Okay, so this actually was a lot easier <laughs> than I thought it would be. I literally thought this would be like at least an hour project. It took me 10, 15 minutes. <laughs> um, I didn't realize I have storage down here as well. Um, I want to take a look at the back real quick. Um, okay, so it does have like plastic. So I'm going to show you guys an idea. I am going to leave these plastic pieces on the high chair because we're not going to need them for a while. And I want to keep this, you know, as pristine as possible. So but keeping the plastic on. Hey, guys. <laughs> Way too crazy. Ah. Um, so let me go get, I have, um, I'm cooking some dinner um, beef stew on the crock pot at the moment. But I have these command hooks. They're like large sizes. Basically, I'm going to take these command hooks and I'm going to stick them right on the back of the high chair, not getting in the in the way of the straps or anything. But I'm gonna make sure I have, I'm gonna have one on either side. Okay, there we go. So I got both the hooks in place. So I do have more bibs, way more bibs than this, but I haven't gone through everything. 
But again, just to give you guys kind of an idea, um, basically the, the idea was to just hang these on the back so that they're like just there and ready to go and easy to reach. Of course, they could use the storage underneath, but I'm thinking about putting like burp cloths under there and like wipes for after he's done eating, kind of like the cleanup kind of stuff. Um, but I'm super excited to have this. Um, also, when we're at the baby shower, my cousin's baby shower, not my baby shower, um, a couple of the people who wasn't able to attend mine brought their gifts. So I have a couple things to show you guys. Um, let me turn on my ring light. I feel like it's a bit dark in here. Okay, hopefully that's a little bit better. Um, but I'll show you guys, we opened up a couple of things. Um, the first thing is like this baby bath lotus flower. Um, so basically you put the lotus flower at the bottom of your sink, you fill up the sink a little bit, you wring it up when you're done and hang it up to dry or you can throw it into the, um, w uh, the dryer. <laughs> um, this came from my aunt and uncle, but I also really like the bag super cute. So I was kind of debating on like holding on to this bag and reusing it but to be honest like I'm trying to like declutter my life. Oh and I just broke it. <laughs> okay <laughs> that made that simple. Um, I also got this little bag of stuff. These are not new. This came from my baby shower but they're baby towels so I want to keep them down here where the bathroom is until the upstairs bathroom is done. But I got this super cute outfit for him. It's like this little I don't know. I don't even know what to crochet onesie with pom poms. I didn't even <laughs> see that at the baby shower. Yeah, Cheyenne, Cheyenne got that. Um, so that's gotta go away in his clothes. Oh, here's your kitty headband. Thank you. You don't have to wear it, but. Um, and then I have more bath stuff. We got a purple set at my baby shower, so now I have more, which, trust me, I feel like you can't have enough of. Orange. And then um, another bath set. It's a hooded towel okay. and three washcloths. So. And then the last thing that I want to show you guys is, I think it would have been my last vlog. Um, just trying to think of how much footage. I don't know if it was in this vlog or last vlog. It's probably last vlog. But this <laughs> mysterious package showed up at my doorstep. And it's not really mysterious because I, I sort of forgot to look out for it, but my aunt said that she sent a package to my house from the baby shower. So she like had a couple of things to show me. I'll show you what it is. She's sitting behind. She's not feeling well, so I gave her a little pop. I just took her temperature. It's 100 exactly. So probably not going to school tomorrow, girlfriend. You gotta stay home with daddy. Um, but, well, you have school tomorrow, but you're not feeling well. And fevers tend to go up before they come down, so. All right. Aww. <laughs> cool. So this is what I was talking about, because we have what's called the proper pillar, which I was saying is kind of like a boppy. But now we actually. It's over there. What? Right there. Another one. Yeah, I know. The, we're open that present. But we got like a little boppy. So they're nice to have. Um, and again, with the prop pillar thing, you can do it all different kinds of ways. Yeah, it has um, zebras and, and lions and. And kitty cats? And, uh, I don't know. No, there's one right there. a kitty cat on it, okay. And a whale and elephants. So very cute. I think, this was, I think this was on my registry when I went to Bye Bye Baby. Um, so cool, very excited. I'm gonna have to send her a message, A, letting her know that it got to me, <laughs> and B, saying um, thank you. So, oh my goodness, I have a lot of cardboard now. It's gonna burn it in a fire. So anyways, I got some cleaning up to do. I just wanna spend some time with you guys today and unpack and all that fun stuff, but I think I'm gonna go take some time, cuddle with her and edit a vlog, and we'll have dinner in like an hour. Or so, so we'll see. I can't even get up. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so sick. <laughs> I'm kind of in like that weird beginning stages of getting sick. She's been sick all week. Um, today happens to be a Thursday. And today was the first day that she actually went to school this week. <laughs> so that girl got a long weekend. Um, 
she ended up getting sick soon after the baby shower that was featured I believe in last vlog it must have been because I haven't vlogged much since but she got sick like the day of the baby shower she started not feeling that hot and then she's been sick ever since so today was the first day that her temperature had finally gone down I'm like get your butt to school <laughs> So I didn't want her miss today either because they were having a school store. So I'm sure I'm going to pick her up in like six minutes. I'm sitting outside of her school right now just waiting. It's too cold to go outside. So I'm going to push it. Um, I'm sure she's going to want to show what she got at the school store today. So prepare for that coming up. Oh my God. My nails are like, oh, yikes. That looks gross. That looks gross. I'm not a dirty person. <laughs> I was cutting carrots today at work and they stained my nails. Oh my goodness, I have to get my nails cut down anyways the next time I go. They're way too long. What's this laser beam doing now in my video? Okay, that's better. I tried cleaning my lens and I think I had made it worse. Um, <laughs> so she's going to show you what she got at the school store. But today was kind of a different school store where they did like... Um, they bring in like $2 to spend on whatever they want. But then they brought in an extra... <laughs> they bring it, bring in an extra two dollars to buy stuff. I can't stop burping. I'm telling you guys, this pregnancy. <laughs> Have I not burped in like every vlog? I'm sorry for being gross. This child is making me so gassy. It's like unreal. Um, luckily out this end most of the time. <laughs> so she had to like buy stuff to donate to kids as well. So they asked to bring in like a two extra dollars or something. Um, so that's what we did today. So I didn't want her to miss that. Um, I think we're going to head home. I have a couple quick little projects to do today as well. Um, no promises, but I, I have to like Thanksgiving is coming up. This vlog is probably going to be posted like closer to Thanksgiving. Um, but I think we're a week out. Is Thanksgiving next Thursday? I feel like Thanksgiving is next Thursday thursday for me like less than a week no exactly a week away from me oh yeah so definitely this vlog actually might even come out after thanksgiving but currently um i need to go find an outfit um i found one on fashion nova this beautiful dress but i almost don't want to buy it because it's kind of it's not really like it's not too bad um on price but I want, if I was to get it, I want it to be like in a smaller size so I could wear it again after my pregnancy. Like I'm too large at the moment. So I think I'm just gonna go to Forever 21, try to find something affordable, but cute for Thanksgiving. And crazy enough, um, I had this iPad that I got years and years and years ago and it wasn't working, it was like locked. The buttons on it were all jacked up and I showed this forever ago. So if any of you remember, I mean, kudos because this was a long time ago, but oh my gosh, this sun just never wants to cooperate, does it? <laughs> no, that's not any better. Um, in a nutshell, um, I just want to go find something quick, but um, because we're going to the mall anyways, I found my old iPad and the problem is my Apple ID that's associated with the iPad like does not exist anymore. Like just doesn't exist. Um, so I need to go to the Apple store and I tried making an appointment. It was like really difficult to try to find how to make an appointment online. Um, so I was gonna call them, but I'm like, you know what? I have to go to a mall anyway. So I'm just gonna try my luck and just like kind of walk in. So maybe I can get my iPad back. Cause that'd be really nice. All right, Miss Ella, you gotta show me what you got from the school store girl. Wait, wait, wait. My, oh, there we go. Okay, we got <laughs> I wanted to focus it. Show me what you got, baby. Ooh, what's that? Oh, a ne new unicorn eraser, a blue one. Yeah. Is that it? Yeah. That's it? That's all you wanted? I know, but I didn't have time to pick out more. Aw, you should have had plenty of time, honey. Oh, look how cute. <laughs> it's awesome. Hey, can I see your dress, too? That they recognize this. Ooh! <laughs> I know it changes color. That's pretty cool. You wanted it on the rainbow one side, right? Yeah. Cool. Look at it. I I really like these. You can erase them, but I don't want to use this on a paper to erase it. Yeah. Because it's so cute. I okay. don't want to even erase it. How are you feeling, girlfriend? 
Aww. <laughs> Gotta stretch it. Hey, we made that cake. You want a piece? Yeah! Okay. I'm not what I consider a perfect parent, but when my kids are messed with, I get really upset. <laughs> um, so I actually have a box to show you guys. I'm gonna quickly go through her folder. Uh-oh. Miss Ella? Where's your folder, babe? I don't know. Is it at school? Yeah, I think it's at school. All right, no biggie. We'll get it tomorrow. We'll get it tomorrow. I'll get you your cake in a minute, okay? So basically, when I picked her up from school, we kind of like wait outside of the school and the teachers tend to start to recognize you as the parent especially like I pick her up almost every day um, unless TJ helps me out or like he's home I should say <laughs> that sounds so bad um so when I went to go pick up Ella they recognized me and they're like oh you have your Yankee Candle fundraiser stuff still in the school which we had a parent teacher conference on Tuesday but that was the day that Ella was feeling really really sick so TJ was home, but only one of us could really go. And because he wasn't at the open house, like I really wanted him to go and meet the teacher. And like, you know what I mean? Like if it was just gonna be one of us, like I'm at every school event. So I wanted to, him to have that opportunity. And I recall reading something where our Yankee Candle fundraisers were gonna be available at that conference. So when he came home with no candles, I, you know, I was a little confused. So anyways, today is Thursday, two days later. I went there to pick her up and we have our Yankee candles. Now this is not all of ours. Um, I know some people bought some online and already got theirs delivered. Um, I know my brother's is in here. A girl named Angie's is in here. Mine and TJ's candles are also in here, which I'll show you guys. But when they told me that my package was available, I took Ella back inside the school. We went over to a classroom and I don't want to say this too loud because I didn't want her feelings to get hurt. And I'm really, really ex like, I don't think she heard this, but when people say stuff about my kids, it irks me in a way <laughs> that is like unfathomable. Like I can't even wrap my head up. Like it makes me angry. Like you can say whatever you want to me. You know what I mean? I've grown a tough skin. I've been online for 10 years now. You know, obviously it's a little different now considering that YouTube has disabled my comments. Um, so I don't like hear the negative stuff as much anymore, but like you can say whatever you want about me, but if you say something about my kid, it's gonna piss me off in a way that is gonna awaken something so deep inside of me. <laughs> And I'm getting ahead of myself, but you ever find yourself, maybe as a parent, maybe not, maybe I'm a terrible person, but hear me out. You ever just wanna knock a little kiddo? Like, <laughs> not that I would, please don't like, don't take me to like seriously, but like these little boys, we pa we walked by, by these little boys. They're obviously gonna remain anonymous. A, I don't know who they are. B, they're minors, I'm not gonna call them out. But we walked by these little boys. Now Ella has been sick all week. I already mentioned that she's had a terrible cold when you get a cold that like underneath your nose gets really raw and so she has like a little like red mark here where the raw skin is and one of the little boys goes oh she has a mustache and I just wanted to <laughs> that little it made me so bad and I don't that's why I say like I you know I don't want her to hear that like she doesn't even have to hear that so like I, you know I kind of looked at her to see if she had like a reaction or something and she like seemed totally oblivious which I'm so grateful for because for god's sakes the girl is in kindergarten and people are already like commenting on the way she the poor thing I just want to mm. <laughs> sorry I was so angry I had to get that out I feel better <sighs> six-year-old boys are not gonna get to me today <laughs> i'm sorry like i said any six-year-old boy can say whatever they want about me but the minute you talk about my kid i'm gonna hurt you anyways let me show you guys real quick what is in this box because she's waiting on a little piece of cake <laughs> um 
I remember ordering, I think I ordered two candles. Um, let me take a while. We ordered these back in October, actually. Um, so like I said, if you ordered like online, you got them pretty quick. If you ordered through a catalog, um, it took some time. So I do have an order form here. I think I'm just gonna have to remember who got what. <laughs> I know what Angie got. I think my brother got one candle. But I'm just gonna call and ask him. Okay. I think this is what Angie got, which is like some um, car fresheners. Oh, we have a lot of candles in here. Yeah, you can see. We got um, spice pumpkin car fresheners, which might be hers or might be my brother's. I'm not sure. Hold on, this whole box is filled with candles, baby. Um, and then we got, where'd that knife go? I use it to show it up the little kids. <laughs> I'm so mad. <laughs> let's um, <laughs> let's open some candles to feel better, huh? Some of these things I will keep wrapped. Um, oh my gosh, I wish I kept. Maybe I did keep. Hold on. Um, I keep forgetting how awesome I am. <laughs> I kept a copy of the order form, so I can tell you exactly um what is what so this the sparkling cinnamon one which i just pulled out is my brother's which smells delicious i must say he has a great taste is this one mine all this says is merry xmas okay maybe i'm not as awesome as I thought. maybe i maybe this was mine because I bought something for $10 and the air fresheners are all about $10. So maybe. Okay, because this must this must be Angie's because this she got fall faves and this is apple pumpkin, spice pumpkin, and autumn wreath. So that sounds obviously like fall. And then I got Merry Christmas, which this is uh, sparkling cinnamon balsam and cedar and Christmas cookies. So this one must be mine. That one's gotta be hers. Plus hers is more expensive. So it looks more expensive. Um, and then we got, let's see, there's another one of these. Oh. What else did my brother get? So he got the sparkling cinnamon and a black cherry. Why does everything get, where did I put? Hold on, oh, there it is. So I know that the black cherry one, wherever that is, is also his and then the rest are TJ's in mine. This one is okay. Black cherry. All right, these two are his. So I'm gonna bring that to work tomorrow so I can give this him. So these two, because I got two items and TJ got one candle. Okay, so there's two more candles in here. So we both got the Woodwick candles. He got whoa. He got Eclipse and I got Fraser Fur. This one is Fraser Fur. And I believe, I literally think when I ordered these, I went online and basically Googled <laughs> what Yankee candles will make your house smell like Christmas. Oh my gosh. Oh, that is so good. That's like straight up Christmas tree. I want to light this right now. The wick is so cool. Oh my gosh. Okay. That one's definitely mine. And then TJ said that he has a little like office space at work. So I wanted to bring one to his job. And he got, oh, this one's cool looking. This one is, wait a minute. This one is also, what? This is called Crimson Berries, Fraser Fur, and White Teak. Ooh. So I'm assuming it has like the three different, like each layer is a different smell. Um, obviously the middle one is what I just pulled out. So the Eclipse Trilogy, Winter Garland, Crimson, uh, Fraser for, and okay, okay, and we got the right one. So this one is his, so I'm gonna light mine up. <laughs> but the fire is so delightful. And since there's no place to go, let us know, let us know, let us know. Ooh. Fancy. Okay. I'ma let it burn. Ooh. 
Oh, these are cool. Okay, I'm gonna stop playing with this. Hi, Arrow. The lights are turned way down low. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. When we finally kiss goodnight, how I hate to go out in the storm. But if you really hold me tight, all the way home I'll be warm. He hates me. <laughs> and me. He's such a big baby. Okay, she's still waiting for her cake.